Oh my god. Hello everybody, it is the same day as my last video, so if you have not checked that out already, go check it out right now. And if you watched my last video, you know that I was on my way home to drop off the boat and head to another location. So right now I'm going to a dam to fish from the top of it, use some night crawlers, some 65 pound braided line, and try to hook into some smallmouth, largemouth, some rock bass, or whatever else bites. I'll see you on the water. Gotta start somewhere, I guess. That might be the same fish. Well, shoot, that was a decent smallmouth. First smallie of the trip and you will not let me get a hook on there we go Small mount number two. Literally using a worm every single cast. Every single cast, every cast.
Oh my gosh. That is a massive bluegill. Another rock bass. Well, I just went through 15 night crawlers in an hour. Every single cast, I either had a bite where it took my worm or I had a fish on. So I'm probably going to come back here tomorrow if it's not raining. There's a chance for some rain tomorrow. So if we are not gonna have any rain, I'm coming right back here tomorrow and grabbing some night crawlers and trying the same exact spot. And if it slows down here, I know another spot nearby that I will try again. So apparently I should have just fished here all day because I fished from 10 o'clock this morning until five o'clock this evening and switched between three different pond or three different lakes or two different lakes i guess i was gonna do four different lakes and then the two of them did not have access for me to get my boat into so i was fishing from 10 o'clock until five o'clock tonight and i only caught a fish starting at three o'clock in the afternoon so i did end up catching like five i think largemouth I lost a few, but with how the bite was here, apparently I should have been here all day. So, if it is not raining, I will see you guys tomorrow. It is the next morning. It is not raining. It rained last night, so hopefully the water is not too high. There's a chance for later this afternoon raining, so I decided to come this morning, try to get out here before it rains. I got 15 more crawlers, and if I run out, there's a gas station just down the road that I can run to real quick. So hopefully the bite is good. Hopefully there's not too much stuff washed in, so it's too murky, but hopefully there's enough washed in to where they're feeding right now. So get the GoPro strapped up. Head out to the bridge. First cast of the day. Rock bass number two. Oh my god. That's bigger than the one from yesterday. Look at that monster blue girl.
First smallmouth of the day. Not believe how big these bluegill are. Massive. Rock bass. Small mouth. Rock bass. Oh my god. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but there was a massive fish that just swam over there and I thought that's what I had on for a second until I realized it was not fighting as much as that should have. I don't know if it was a giant catfish or a pike or what it was, but it was huge. Smaller rock bass. my last worm too.
just went through 15 worms in like an hour and a half again. So I think I'm gonna call it a day. Caught quite a few fish. I really wish I could have gotten into that one that I saw swirl up at the top so I could find out what it was, but did not get the chance. And I hope you guys like this GoPro angle. I hope I got it figured out so that you can see a lot of what I see because once I get off to school, this is what a lot of my videos are going to be like, I think. So, thank you for watching. It was a very good day on the water. I really like it when I can just catch fish pretty much every single cast or at least have a bite every single cast. It makes it a lot more entertaining and worthwhile coming out here fishing. So, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you next time.